Hello, can I speak to Mikey? Oh, yeah. This truth teller from where are the truth tellers, bro? Oh, yeah. Man, how you doing, big homie? I appreciate you giving me a chance to talk to you, bro. Yeah, Oh, man, that's what's up, bro. I didn't talk to a lot of people in the industry, bro, and I got over 200 DMs telling me to holler at you, big homie. I don't know, no doubt, no doubt, that's what's up. Man, I'm rocking with the movement, bro. I want to know how, I mean, I, me personally, I've been seeing you doing this for a while. I'm a street reporter, so I keep my ears to everything. But, bro, how did it get to the point where you kind of blast off everybody rocking with you? Shit, personally, shit, it does really work the hard work, shit, but. You know, I'm a real street nigga, so you know, I know a lot of niggas who, you know what I'm saying, already doing their thing and shit, so I just really get a lot of help from my friends who I fuck with on the streets and shit. Right. I checked it out, bro. I've been rocking with it for a while. There's something about it that kind of feel authentic, bro. I was rocking with the KTG movement, too. That's still going on? Yeah, you know, we still, brother. Shit, you know how that go, but we ain't a group no more. You know, we start off as MIC and shit. Right. Um, look, Chris and Hill Will and shit, but... <laughs> right. Man, big homie, how do you, I, you know, it's a lot of up and coming artists be watching and seeing what I'm doing, bro. If you had any advice for any artist that's trying to get out there, because you buzz pretty quick, you got any advice for an artist who's trying to come up, bro? I be trying to tell everybody, man, all they really got to do is work hard, man, keep it going, like, keep it consistent, man, make sure the shit A1, make sure the quality good, man, try to keep it, because... You gotta drop them visuals. The visuals, like, it's cool to make songs and shit, but if you ain't dropping nothing for it, you know what I'm saying? Right. They're calling people to keep up with it, really. You know what I'm saying? They wanna see some, you know what I'm saying? Some action. Man, that's true, bro. I, you know, and I done asked a lot of artists this question, bro, and since you're from the streets, bro, and I know your name official out there in Chicago, I was wondering, could you give me some insight of why is it so dangerous in Chicago, bro? Shit, because, shit, it's a chain reaction, like, you know what I'm saying? Chicago is different from every everywhere else, bro. Like, I'll be in a lot of places, bro. Ain't nowhere like Chicago niggas, you know what I'm saying? It's, like, niggas in Chicago, like, where niggas really savage niggas we live like. Right. It's like, like, motherfuckers raised, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's a chain reaction, bro, you know what I'm saying? Being like, so many people getting killed. Like, when a motherfucker family member get killed, ain't nobody trying to hear that shit about that shit over with, you know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's like, the big chain reaction, they get killed. Like, they, they better get killed. I think it's gonna kill everybody until it, you know what I'm saying? Right. That's real, bro. So, what you got coming out, big homie? Uh, I just dropped a, uh, a mixtape, you know what I'm saying? That was everywhere. Like, um, it was like a mixtape, you know what I'm saying? Uh. Yeah, it was everywhere. Uh. Pitch Me Rolling. I got some shit. Yeah, I'm rocking with that Pitch Me Rolling. Yeah, that shit go crazy. I'm gonna drop some shit on um, June 21st. Oh, that's I got people trying to do that more with most of it. You know what I'm saying? But I got like a few more tapes too that I'm gonna drop. Like just to be dropping, you know what I'm saying? I got some more for drop with Ill Will and Lil Chris too. Uh, yeah, yeah, Lil Chris. Shout out Chris. Shout out Ill Will. Yeah, yeah. Shout out Lil Bro. I'm in LA right now working on an EP with Salva. Salva Beats. Uh. Salva Beats. That got beats for me and Lil. Uh, that's a good look right there, big homie. So what you doing, bro? You gonna keep it independent or you taking it to the majors, bro? Whatever the money got. <laughs> That's real, bro. Man, anybody want to get up with you, bro, do a feature with you, or they just want to give you a bag of money because they're rocking with your movement, what's your Instagram, what's your Twitter? You can just Google me. You know what I'm saying? All my information will pop up. At Mikey Dollars, M-I-K-E-Y-D-O-L-L-A-Z. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can just Google me. You know what I'm saying? All my information will pop up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Oh, yeah, bro, before I let you go, big homie, I heard, I heard through rumors, bro, that you got some new music coming out with, uh, with, uh, uh Key to Queen. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 we got some heat, some heat, heat. Like, we went to the studio and made, like, a few tracks, ask me. Right. We were thinking about, um, we were thinking about fucking around and doing a little tape or whatever, like a 10 song tape or something just to be fun. Uh. Man, that's a good look, bro. You know, I told you I'm a street reporter, big homie, so my ears and my eyes on everything. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so I can keep you updated on all your hip-hop and your latest news and all your Chirac news. It's the homie Truth Teller. Blech!